Hi Gemini, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your general weekly message from January 7th into the 13th, 2019. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box. So let's get started. Whomever this is meant for, uh, you first start off with the chariot. Major arcana meaning that uh, movement, but they're focusing me on the sphinx here. So it's kind of like tires to that movement where it's kind of like divided in between, like which way do I go, George, kind of feeling, okay? I feel that you are there for your uh, your own power. You're standing in your own power, trying to make some type of decision, uh, which is on your right path, I feel. I feel that Spirit's trying to guide you on your right path to make some type of decision in regards to a new beginning of love with the Ace of Cups here. I do feel that you've been in this stagnation moment in regards to the Hangman, Major Call. Uh, Major Arcana, sorry, but I do feel that you are going to be making some type of decision or you have made some type of decision to end that mental anguish, to end those burdens in your life and you're taking it quite seriously as well, I feel, with the Emperor here. Now this is uh, Aries energy, so you could be dealing with an Aries, but the energy of kind of like, I'm just sick of this. I mean, his eyes are literally shifted over saying, I'm done. I'm done with this stagnation. I'm done uh, with these burdens. I'm contemplating this decision. I don't know which direction to make. I don't know which direction to go in in regards to a decision in regards to love. You're pondering this. You're frustrated over a situation. Uh, because I feel that you want to move forward with your thoughts, okay? Swords represent your thoughts. And the Six of Swords is moving out of choppy waters, but I clarified it with the Hermit. So the Hermit to me is that you're deep in your thoughts. You know, you're literally turned looking at this. It's kind of like you're causing like your own roadblock. I feel a lot of confusion in regards to this situation is what I'm feeling. Bottom line is this, your outcome Ten of Cups. So you want this fulfillment in regards to a love situation, but you're stressed out over it with the Nine of Swords. Okay? Literally turn looking at that moon card of secrets being kept, kind of left out in the dark kind of feeling with those two towers tells me to make a decision to bring balance back in your life again. But you have two options here, you know? I feel that you are kind of like at a crossroad kind of feeling in regards to movement with those Sphinx going in opposite directions of each other. It's kind of like you have to stand in your power to make this decision to have a new in regards to a relationship here that has been stagnant uh, with that lover's card. This is your energy as well. So you're very, especially with the King of Swords here, you're very much in your power, but it's kind of like you're pondering this thought, you're frustrated, and you just want to stop. You just want to end this, you know, take it seriously, having that control and ending the burdens. But it's kind of like you're roadblocking yourself with your thoughts because what you want, what you desire is basically balance, okay? You want this fulfillment of love. You just don't know which direction to go in is what I'm feeling here in regards to making a decision, absolutely, in regards to a new start, ending that stagnation. Uh, it's frustrating because one minute I feel that, you know, you want this new beginning with this person. The other moment is just like I'm done, you know, kind of feeling. But it's kind of like I'm thinking about this person. I'm hoping and wishing with my thoughts here. But I'm being blocked by my own thoughts to move forward, to move past this. So I feel that you're kind of entrapped in your mind, I feel, in the dark as to what to do. Okay, because I feel that... You know, you give, 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 and yet there's no balance here. So I feel that that's what that frustration is all about, to end the burdens, I feel, but yet with your thoughts, you're deep in your thoughts of what you truly want. So there's that crossroad of making that decision, okay? And I feel that spirit's basically trying to urge you to start anew, okay? Make that decision to start anew, not just for in regards to a relationship per se, but to love yourself as well is what this is saying. So anyway, that is what I have. Regain that balance for you guys uh, is the message here. Yeah, see, they make me zoom in on certain things. Here's that little tear in his outfit there. So this has been, you're kind of torn is what I'm feeling between two different scenarios here. And you just don't know, you know. Uh, so make that decision to, you know, realize what, truly lies for yourself in your mind in your heart 
and love yourself is what I really feel here to regain balance back into your life again. <clears throat> Excuse me. And that is what I have for whomever this is meant for. I hope that this helps. Uh, please subscribe to my channel as well as click that little bell on the side to get updated information. I do weeklies as well as dailies and now monthlies. You guys have a great week and I'll talk to you soon.